What's up guys? Thanks for coming back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing another unboxing vid. I got a box. I got a video. So, uh, this is the Rogue LX205B we're going to be opening up today. I had some issues getting it and you're going to like this one. So stay tuned. Don't forget to like and subscribe to see more. Okay guys, so as always I didn't bring a box cutter. I got a key. Let's tear into it. Now, online I've seen... And I believe these come in two different boxes. A box inside of a box, essentially. And I brought the dullest key to the party. Let's do it. We cut out all the BS and went straight to the point. Rogue LX205B. Now I got this in the pearl white. I originally ordered red. I had an alert set on my phone to tell me when red was available because it was on back order and out of stock for months and I had been trying and trying because I wanted that base so bad. So I had the alert uh, set on my phone which is a feature that uh, Musician's Friend order, or offers online. I got this from Musician's Friend by the way. And uh, if they don't have something in, in uh, stock currently you can set an alarm for them to message you when it's available. Well, I had them do this with the color I wanted, and they told me, hey, it's available. Within 10 minutes of getting that text, I ordered it. It said, confirmation complete, all that. Order's good to go. It'll be there in five days. After three days, they sent me an email and said, oops, we messed up. Your item is now on back order. Sorry. So I'm like, okay. And they returned me my money. So I'm like, when am I getting my base? So I waited a couple weeks, and finally I got the time to call them. I called and they said I will not be getting my base till July. Uh, I don't know if any of you guys seen on the news, uh, a giant ship um, got stuck in like the Panama Canal or something and it was carrying a bunch of goods from China and evidently it was on that ship. Go luck, or go figure my luck there. So I ended up getting the white one which is normally a little bit more expensive than the red um, and they gave it to me for the same price after some... Uh, quick negotiating skills on my part. But anyways, without any further ado, here's the white five string Rogue LX 205B. Oh yeah, you gotta love this paper. After a while I just start tearing it into it. Oh man, the maple on the neck looks great. So, let me check over everything here. There she is, the Rogue LX205B 5 string. So it's got a two piece neck. Thing still got the stickers on it. Black hardware is very nice. Made in China. All in all, I would have to say this is a very good base. All the fret markers are smooth. I checked, the neck is still straight. It managed to make it through uh, the shipping, which, if you look here, doesn't look like uh, they were very gentle at all times. But it managed to make it here safely, which is good. Uh, I had it delivered through UPS. It took about four days, I think, from once I finally worked everything out. And uh, the camera might not be picking this up, but it actually has a nice metallic flake to the paint. And the black on the head's very shiny. I like it a lot, really. Great base. And this is actually my first five string I've ever owned. So that was one of my main reasons for ordering this. Uh, all in all, I would definitely recommend. The fretboard doesn't feel uh, grainy at all. There are like a couple black spots. I'm not sure if that's the wood itself or if possibly it got stained in the process. Plastic nut. But yeah, looks like a very solid base. I've had great reviews on it. Um, 
today I'm not going to plug it in and play it or anything. I'm just going to do an unboxing video. And as far as what I see, it, it looks and feels great. The knobs are very smooth, not wobbly or, or gritty or anything like that. No flaws in the body that I can see. Uh, you can see the uh, a couple of brush strokes, but nothing very noticeable at all. It has a satin finish on the back of the, the neck here. Maple, which is my favorite. And if you look here close at the back of the, the head, the wood grain is actually different. Which is a nice feature. But yeah, that's the Rogue LX205B Series 3. And I got this in white. So, uh, if you were to ask me, I would say I highly recommend. Um, has a good sturdy bridge. Everything feels great. Like it was made with uh, quality craftsmanship for the most part. Um, I'm not sure about the strings yet. I'm sure they're just cheap ones from the factory. I plan on putting some fender strings on here. Uh... I got this off of um, Musician's Friend for $109.99. Now, mind you, that was during a sale. Uh, normally, this guitar runs for $179.99. And even during the sale, it went for $119.99. But I happened to get a decent deal on it. So, uh, if you were to purchase this right now, it would be $180 base. I did work my magic and got it for $110. But we will not talk about that. So, yeah, all in all, I highly recommend the Rogue LX205B. Thank you guys for watching. Feel free to like, subscribe, ring the bell, and uh, stay tuned for more. We're going to be unboxing lots of other things besides musical instruments, but uh, lately it's been the, the kick that I'm into. So, uh, if that's your thing, stay tuned because we'll be doing more instruments as well. Thanks, guys.